blue ink, please? Jupiter? Jupiter, what are you doing over there? I'm looking for more stamps. There must be more around here. Found one. Oh, that's not a stamp. Found one. Look at this, Clyde. What did you find, Jupiter? A fish stamp. Huh? Grandpa, can yeah. we use this fish stamp? Ah, that's not a fish stamp, Jupiter. That's a fossil. It's not a stamp. <gasps> Luna, it's not a stamp. It's a frost reel. A what? <laughs> he means a fossil, right, Jupiter? Yeah. A fossil? But it looks just like a fish. Well, that's because it's a fish. I mean, it's a fossil of a fish. I have a really good book about fossils back at the house. A fish fossil? But how did it get inside this rock? Yeah, how? I've got to know. I've just got to know. My book about fossils. What a pretty book, Grandpa. Yeah, and it's full of all sorts of interesting facts all about fossils. Mm. Wow, a butterfly fossil. It's a dragonfly, huh? Jupiter. Oh, mm. wow. It's just so, mm. so, <laughs> so scientific. <laughs> A dinosaur. Neato! They're looking for fossils and finding all sorts of neat stuff. A footprint. You're right, Jupiter. A footprint. Mm. And footprints are marks. That's it! Fossils are marks left by animals that lived in the past. Animals like dinosaurs? Yes, <laughs> like dinosaurs. <laughs> I have a great idea for our experiment. <laughs> Let's make our very own fossils. Needle. Yeah! Let's leave our prints huh? in the mud and make our own fossils. Huh? <laughs> your turn, Jupiter. Put your hand here. No, Luna. I'm gonna make a belly button fossil. <laughs> it's gonna be way better. <laughs> I think I want to make my fossil better too. <laughs> of a T-Rex fingernail. Look! Negative, Jupiter. This little rock is interesting, but it's just a cute little green rock. Oh man, I really wanted to find a dinosaur fossil. <laughs> then let's find some. We just have to make believe we're fossil explorers and find more fossils. I'm gonna find a T-Rex fossil. Wait, no. Three, three T-Rex fossils. <laughs> We're explorers. With really neat tools. Look. There must be lots of fossils here. Perfect for our excavation. Let's uh -huh. find some dinosaur fossils. Yeah. Print. Here, here. Huh. There's something over here. Leave it to me. One, two, three. Three T-Rex fossils. 
I told you, I told you. Did I say I'd find them? Wow! Three Tyrannosaurus Rex fossils! Incredible! They're so big! They must have lived a long time ago. There's only bones here. You think? I wonder if they lived a really long time ago. I know. My aha can help us find out. <gasps> they lived a long time ago. Before I was born? Millions of years ago. These three T-Rexes lived about 110 million years ago. Wow. That's even before Grandpa and Grandma were born. You think 110 million years ago there were Ferratosaurus Rexes? People must have tamed the dinosaurs and rid of them like they were horses. Right, Luna? I have no idea. But I know how we can find out. <laughs> We're going to travel in time. Real life T Rexes, here we come. <laughs> come here, T Rex. Come on, boy. I don't think it's a good idea to call over T Rexes. What if it's their snack time? <laughs> they look like they're scared. Hi, T Rex. We come in peace. What a strange smell. What kind of animal are you? They're so little. They must be insects, right? But insects have wings. These must be fish. But out of water? Ah, amphibians. Are they frogs? We're not insects or fish or frogs. You don't know what we are? Hmm. <laughs> We're humans, hmm. and Clyde is our <laughs> parrot. I've never seen humans around here. Are you from Earth? The dinosaurs don't know about humans. We're from the same planet, but we come from the future to find out what life was like when dinosaurs were alive. There aren't any humans yet, but everything is very green. There are insects, birds, amphibians, dinosaurs. Hmm, and what kind of dinosaurs live in the future? They're all fossils. Huh? We'd better get back. We can't tell them about the future. They'll be sad if they find out they don't exist anymore. Back to the present. I mean, in make-believe. <laughs> back to our T-Rex fossils. So you'd like to know what is a fossil? One, two, three, I'll tell you all about fossils. So, so you'd like, like to know what is a fossil? One, two, three, I'll tell you all about fossils. Millions of years ago, on the Earth, dinosaurs did roam. There were no humans, no. The world was very different, you know. What are fossils, you ask? They're marks from the past. Footprints from an bones. The sediments turned into stone. Bones can be fossils, and footprints can be fossils. Animals from long ago, history of life, you know. Rocks, amber, tar, or ice. Even in other fossils, you can find fossils. So do you like to know what is a fossil? One, two, three, I'll tell you all about fossils. So do you like to know what is a fossil? One, two, three, I'll tell you all about fossils. This is the best experience ever! <laughs> There must have been tons of dinosaurs on Earth. We met three, just in our make-believe. Mm. Yeah, but if it hadn't been for the fossils, we never would have known. I have an amazing idea for our fossil show. Hi, Grandpa. Hi, Grandma. I'm Lunasaurus Rex. And I'm going to bring on to stage my T-Rex friends, Jupitosaurus Rex and Clydosaurus Rex. <laughs> so you'd like to know what is a fossil? One, two, three, I'll tell you all about fossils. So you'd like to know what is a fossil? One, two, three, I'll tell you all about fossils.
I wonder what sand is made of. How many grains of sand are here? So many questions! La, la, la.